tool I want to show in this video is the Milwaukee M4 screwdriver model number 2101-20 now the kit I've got is the 2101-22 which means it comes with battery charger and two of the four volt batteries which they hold a charge for a pretty good amount of time the good thing about the the Milwaukee M4 is it's compact it's got two speeds it's got a drill feature on it which meaning it just doesn't use the clutch this has a very low torque uh, capability so it's perfect for just panel screws panel screws and uh, taking out screws you know like a Phillips screws or Torx whatever you can put a bit in so th the good thing is it also can be used as a manual screwdriver because let's say the battery dies on you you're not you can manually turn it it, uh, it stays this doesn't turn well, it's not freewheeling but the good thing I like about this is you can use it straight at a 45 down is out the top is in you know that's the direction the screw is going to go it's going to go in or it's going to go out it's pretty intuitive once you learn it it's it's just like second nature so I normally like to break the the tension with the screw you know without using the battery and then I just back it out but the good thing is I like to set it on a low torque setting I'm gonna set it on two that's the lowest and it stops you're not going to strip out your panel screws I mean, it's awesome see it just stops and you can set it for higher torque if you want you'll get the feel for it but it's a really good little handy driver and it fits nicely in a bag without taking up a lot of real estate now see it's that there is because the, the clutch it's not got enough torque so that's why I like to break them loose there you go and then it stops but that's the Milwaukee 2101 4 volt driver get it online that's about the only place I can find it's online uh, I don't believe Home Depot carries it I believe when I checked they didn't have it in stock and it was like a you know you could order it online so if you if you're going online you pretty much can order from anybody you want um, but it's a nice compact driver quarter inch chuck lift and release and I believe you can just push it to get it go in there yeah the speed this is uh, speed 2 speed 2 actually it tells you uh, I believe it's 200 on speed one and 600 on uh, speed two, the RPM. So speed one, or speed two, I'm sorry, speed two, speed one, speed two. The drill feature, you can't drill with it. You can't put a chuck. Uh, a drill that's got the hex the quarter inch hex on it and drill out with it it'll uh, just doesn't have the capacity to do that matter of fact let's just see if it does because setting two let's see how it does on sheet metal now this is I believe 26 gauge so let's see if it can drive a screw in there all right. 
got enough gumption to drive a screw in a 26 gauge. Now let's see if it can drive. We can take a 3 16 bit and just go through a 2 by 4. So we've got a 2 by 4. All right, now this is a battery has a full charge on it, so realize that. Let's try a quarter inch bit. She's struggling. Yeah. Quarter inch bit. Dare I even try a 3 8 bit? I dare, I dare. And I'm still at four bars. Still got four bars, or four, four blips. Now I'm gonna go slow on this. And realize this thing's really not made to do this. This is, this is like an emergency situation. Let's say you've got to drill a hole. A little turd made it. All right. All right. Let's say you got a situation where you would need to put a quarter inch access fitting in a piece of copper pipe. Will it do it? See if I can set this up. Freestyle here. Oh my gosh. All right. Now this is gonna be hard to do. All right, where are we at? Here we at. All right, I'm through. Want to catch though, right at the last. Look at that. Got it to go. So the doggone thing's got a lot more torque than I give it credit for. But there you go. The Milwaukee 2101, four volt screwdriver. It's handy to have, and this will, you, this keeps it locked, but what happens is if you don't unlock it, it'll keep it on, so it becomes, like I said, it becomes just pretty intuitive to operate it, you know, backing out screws, putting screws in, you can use it with your thumb, you know, you're using it like this, back and forth, straight up and down, and you can use it manually if the battery dies on you in the middle of something. But it will, uh, as you see, it'll drive a sheet metal screw into 26 gauge pretty easily. It will uh, go through up to 3 8 that I tried. It'll go through a 2 by 4 So it'll drill through metal as well. It'll drill through copper pipe. If you need to drill a hole for an access fitting, you know, that's quarter inch. So, you know, 3 16 quarter inch shouldn't be an issue. Uh, it's pretty versatile and fits in your tool bag real sweet like so that's what's in my tool bag the Milwaukee 2101 hope this was informative hope you enjoyed the video thanks for watching